Hi, my name is Cindy, and today I'm gonna talk about tree hopper ant. Have you ever heard about tree hopper ants? Everyone knows what the ants are, but I'm pretty sure that most of the people don't know what the tree hopper ants are. There are many kinds of tree hoppers in the world, and some of them mimic something. For example, Cirrusa terina is a kind of tree hopper that looks like a leaf. These tree hopper ants are also known as the ant mimicking tree hopper. It looks like an ant, but if you look closer, you can recognize that it isn't an ant, but another insect. Their appearance is very similar to ants, which keeps them safe from their predators by pretending to be an ant. The plan is that any predator looking down will only see what looks like an ant, not tree hopper. The rest of the tree hopper's body will blend in the leaves, except for this tree hopper ant. What seems at first is that the body of the ant is posi positioned backward on that of the tree hopper. If you take a look at the tree hopper ant, you will see the tiny green eyes of the tree hopper in the back of their body. And why is this? It's because when it is defensive mode, a treehopper ant will move backward, or any other ants. In this way, the ant mimicking treehopper can go more smoothly to the backward. In conclusion, the treehopper ants defend and adopt themselves as mimicking the ants and with the eyes that can watch the back. So they can walk backward, as I said, better than other normal ants. I want to end with my thought during the research. I knew about the tree hoppers that mimic the leaves because I saw a few of them in Korea too. But I never heard about tree hoppers that mimic ants. When I saw the picture of it at first, I literally thought it was an ant. And I was so confused about ant and tree hopper ants because it looks just the same. But then I saw the throne on the head and the green eyes in the backside. It was a very interesting topic for me. Thank you for listening to my presentation.